Hello everybody and just another quick film uh, absolutely fantastic the amount of people who's been in touch about um, the weasel ferrets and just a little thing about how big weasel ferrets are weasel micro ferrets but I like to call them weasel ferrets um, I've got some taxidermy here uh, the 19... 20s, 1930s taxidermy of a, a stoat and a weasel. Um, the weasel is very small, but they are anyway. So I'm just going to show you uh, the, the size of the ferrets um, up to them. Now this is the albino you've seen who had a litter this year. And she's exactly the same size as the stoat. Probably the length of the weasel, but a bit more bulkier. But to be fair, that's the fur of her. She's probably a bit smaller actually than the uh, stoat. But she'll be working this September. That's the albino. And that's my little polecats. So she's exactly the same size as the stoat. between the stoat and the weasel now she had a litter she had a litter of four this year See and then the final one is a little sandy and that looks exactly the, it just looks like the stoat. That's a little sandy. The weasel is probably the same kind of length. But the stoat matches them perfect. So that's the kind of size you're looking about. 175 200 gram but them are the working size and straight and as you can see she just fluffed up there she's not sure about the taxidermy but yeah the micro weasel ferrets I've got a little job to do at a garden centre, they've phoned me up, they've seen some small rabbits. So we've just got to go down, so I'll take these three and we'll just see if we can flush out out. Now, just come up to the garden centre and the lurchers just mark this drainage pipe i've just blocked the end could be a little bit late at the other end just there i've just put another purse net over the end of the pipe but they could have run through and run out into the edge so uh, we'll just put a 
couple of ferrets down. I think she could have had young down here. On the nets over there, dogs over here. Just have a listen now. So the ferrets come out of there at the top. So, what happened when the lurcher came up? Obviously the rabbits run through here, went down his pipe, and now... He's done a job. We can go back down. So... Yeah, so what the rabbits have done, come out and they've run into this area here. So the next job tomorrow is have a look inside and to see any of these warrens. Well, that's a cracking lid. These rabbits are nifty. When these garden, in these garden centres, they can cause some damage. So uh, I'll be on that tomorrow. So that's a little look. And the uh, weasel ferrets in action and it's actually been all the way through that pipe <laughs>